In this video, we're going to take a quick look at how to organize apps on your iPad. So let's start by moving some apps around. Before you can move apps around, you have to start by pressing and holding on one of the apps until they all start to shake. To move an app around, simply drag it to another place in the screen and you'll see the other apps will politely move out of the way. To move apps to a new screen, simply take the app and drag it over towards the edge of the screen, pause there for a second, and you see the iPad flips open a new screen for you. Some people find this a little hard to do, so the other way of moving apps between screens is to take your app and drag it down to the dock. Once it's in the dock, you can move back to the screen that you would like the app to be on and drag it back up from the dock. Once you're done, press the home button to stop the apps shaking. To put apps in a folder, press and hold on an app. Once they are all shaking, take one app and hover over the top of another app. Let go and the folder will be created. By default, Apple creates a title for your folder, but that can be changed very easily by tapping on the X and typing a new name for your folder. To exit the folder, tap outside of the square. And to add a new app to the folder, just drag that one back to where your folder is. In iOS 7, you can now add the newsstand to a folder and any number of apps that you wish to have in a folder. You are no longer limited to 20 apps in a folder. Folders can, of course, be added down here to the dock, and they can also be moved between screens as well, depending on what your needs are. Apps can be taken out of folders too. Simply tap on the folder and drag the app outside of the box and let go. Once you're done, tap the home button. Deleting apps is very simple to do. Again, you start by pressing and holding on one of the apps. The apps will start to shake, and you should notice on some of your apps an X in the top left-hand corner of the icon. Now, as you can see, some of these apps do not have an X in the corner. That's because these are the default Apple apps, and you cannot delete those. However, the one in the bottom left of my screen does have an X in the corner. To delete the app, I tap on the X. I get a confirmation message saying it will delete all the data that has been created inside the app. Tap delete and the app is gone. Once I'm done, hit the home button. To search for an app on your iPad, take one finger, place it in the middle of your screen and pull down. This reveals the search bar at the top of your page. Simply type in the name of the app that you're looking for and tap on it to launch the app. To go back to your home screen, hit the home button. And that's how you organize apps on an iPad.